Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm gonna go over what I would want in Resident Evil 9 and some of the stuff I actually think probably could happen. Not all of it, but some of it would just be cool to see actually happen in the game, but I don't know if they ever would actually do that. But before we get started, if you enjoyed this video, it'd really help if you could leave a like and subscribe. But with that, let's get into what I would want to see in Resident Evil 9. The first thing I would like would be to see Jill in the game in some way. Even if she's not going to be the main character of the game, if she'll be like a secondary character or something. Or a support character. I'd just like to see her back in the franchise in some way. Because <laughs> since Resident Evil Death Island, we know she's back working and doing stuff. So it's probably pretty likely we will see her in the game in some way. Even if Leon is going to be the protagonist, it'd probably make the game way more interesting if Leon and Jill are the two main protagonists of the game. Because that's one of the main team-ups everybody's wanted for a long time, so it'd be really cool to see. I would also like the game to be more horror-focused and action-focused. Because even with Resident Evil 8, it still was mostly action, had a bit of horror in it, but I'd like to see it back on like... As an evil one or two or because i think that'd be a good way to get people back playing not that people won't be playing but it'd just be really cool to see them go back to being more horror which it could happen i assume it probably will because i don't think they're going with the end of uh resident evil 8 chris story with the bsaa cloning him I assume they're doing a different story, but who knows? I would like to see the game have multiple protagonists, not just one main character like Leon and Jill or maybe even Claire and Leon, but I doubt that. It'd just be cool to have more than one main protagonist, not some new person they introduce like Ethan, like Chris and Leon or Jill and Leon or something like that. And I would like them to go back to having actual zombies, not like creatures like the lichens from resident evil 8 i think that's what they're called they're cool but i'd like to see them go back to being traditional zombies if they're gonna go more horror focused it'd make more sense to do like zombies or something like that and also if leon is gonna be the main protagonist i'd like to see them bring ada in somehow could probably rewrite the story from resident evil 8 that they cut where ada was gonna be in it they could probably put figure out a way to put that in resident evil 9 It'd be pretty cool to see Ada, even if Leon's not the main protagonist. It'd be pretty cool. And the last thing I have written down for what I would want to see is probably the most unlikely thing they'll do, which is seeing the game take place in the ruins of Raccoon City. I don't see that ever happening for probably any game, but it'd just be really cool to see. It probably would make a lot of people interested to see what the heck they can do with that. It'd be a good way to bring the classic zombies back if they went back to Raccoon City. Because it's been a very long time in the universe since Raccoon City, so it's probably long enough they could probably do, figure out something to do with it by now. Because then they can do a that where they go back to Raccoon City and then they have Chris, Claire, Jill, and Leon all in one game as protagonists. Yeah, first time you see Chris in Raccoon City, it could be pretty cool and it would be a good way to make the game more horror focused if they went back to raccoon city i don't know if what they would do with raccoon city if they would have made them like build up raccoon city so that it's kind of a city again or if they would have just left it in a big crater in the ground if not i'm not raccoon city i'd like to see them go back to some sort of like town city not a small little village or something like that in the middle of nowhere because those are cool but they're kind of getting little old because they've been doing them a lot once they go back to like city or something then they can start doing that again but there hasn't been many cities in a long time so or towns even with buildings and i think my number one thing is i want to see leon and jill be the two main protagonists just because they're they'd be a really cool dynamic in the game as the two protagonists of the game i don't know if they'd do a stalker enemy probably not but the most likely thing I see happening is Jill and Chris will probably be the two protagonists of the game. They're the two I most likely see being the protagonist because Chris is, seems like they're not done with Chris yet. And 
everybody's been asking for Jill, so they're probably going to do figure out some way to have Jill incorporated into the game. And having Chris there just makes sense, so. And Claire, I don't see probably being in the game at all, because they kind of rewritten her character entirely. Where the only way she'll be in the game is if somehow the main characters are kidnapped or something. And then she ends up half having to go through with whatever's in the game. But then those are some of the few things I would like to see in the game. Right now I'm working on a lore video on the Hunters from Resident Evil. Should be out hopefully within the next week. I've been slowly working on it so it's actually going to be made well. But if you guys enjoyed this video, it would really help if you could like and subscribe. And thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>